Erwin Allen Ginsberg was born on June 3, 1926, in Newark, New Jersey, U.S., to a Jewish family. His father, Louis Ginsberg, was a schoolteacher and occasional poet, and his mother, Naomi Levy, a Russian emigrant, was a Marxist. He developed an interest in political issues as a young boy and began writing letters to the New York Times on issues like World War II and workers' rights when he was a teenager. He graduated from Eastside High School in 1943 and joined Montclair State College. He left the college soon after and enrolled in Columbia University after getting a scholarship from the Young Men's Hebrew Association of Patterson. He joined the Merchant Marine while still studying to earn money to fund his education. He contributed to the Columbia Review Literary Journal and served as president of the literary and debate group Philalexian Society. Throughout his childhood and youth, he struggled to come to terms with his mother's mental illness. She suffered from a psychological illness that often manifested as paranoid delusions. She was never properly diagnosed and was sent to a mental institution and her behavior became exceedingly erratic. Who was Allen Ginsberg? Allen Ginsberg was a poet, writer, and human rights activist who was a pivotal figure of the revolutionary beat generation. An outspoken individual, he voiced his views against capitalism, militarism, nuclear weapons, censorship, materialism, and sexual repression in his works. He openly advocated for homosexual rights and called for the peaceful coexistence of people having diverse views and opinions. The son of a poet and schoolteacher, he developed an early love for writing. He began publishing his poems while still in high school and received a scholarship to attend Columbia University. During this time, he became acquainted with several future writers including Jack Kerouac and William S. Burroughs, with whom he would collaborate later. He moved to San Francisco and built a solid reputation as a poet representing the new generation. As a poet, he played a major role in popularizing the beat generation and is credited to have contributed to the development of an American vernacular in poetry. As an activist, he participated in decades of political protests. Born into a Jewish family, he later developed a fascination for Eastern religious disciplines and embraced Buddhism. He adopted a very simple lifestyle, living in modest apartments and purchasing things from second-hand stores.